Looking for some delicious Indian food in Paris? Tonight we will be dining at the Le du Lys du Cashmere, located near the Edgar Quinet metro station on Green Line 6 within Paris's business district. The interior of the establishment was well put together and had an inviting vibe. For drinks, we ordered a pair of Bongo and Banana Lassi, an Indian style yogurt drink. Both tasted good, although the Banana Lassi was a bit too warm. The Mango Lassi was nice and cold due to the Mango ice cream that it was derived from. The server was nice enough to offer us two glasses of Mango juice on the house. My girlfriend ordered the chicken combination plate that consisted of a masala chicken, vegetarian and lentil dal, salad with a yogurt based dressing and basmati rice. We ordered the chicken masala but was given the tandoori chicken. The vegetable dal was lighter and sweeter than the lentil dal. The yogurt dressing went well with the salad and the basmati rice was cooked well and full of aroma. I ordered a plate of tandoori chicken and butter chicken curry. The tandoori chicken was presented fresh out of the oven on a burning hot cast iron plate. You can hear that satisfying sizzling sound. That's what I call ASMR. The chicken was incredibly well coated, well spiced, savory on the bite with a hint of limey spiciness. I discovered that lime juice and sizzled onions make for a good flavor pairing as well. The butter chicken curry was definitely the star of the show. Topped with a variety of spices and sliced almonds, the sauce of the butter chicken curry had a rich and creamy texture. Every bite was an explosion of flavors, taking my taste buds to paradise. This was a reminder for me that chicken can be a great protein vessel if prepared with care and skill. Finally, our naan arrived. My girlfriend ordered the regular naan, which was cooked perfectly. I got the garlic naan, half of which was burnt to my disappointment. The edible portions were lathered in ghee butter and minced garlic. The garlic naan had a nice crunchy and soft texture on the bite. It was enough for me to overlook the imperfections. The naan served as a perfect vessel for dipping into the butter chicken curry sauce. The combination of bread, chicken, and sauce felt so right. Also stacking the sizzling lime onions with the garlic and butter naan and then eating it was like entering a whole new world. Overall an incredibly flavorful dining experience with a friendly staff and decent service. There were definitely aspects of the food that could have been presented better. The place was packed with people that were also passionate about Indian food which added to the ambiance. Thank you for watching and tune in next time for more eating adventures in Paris.